My name is Gary Lum. My name is May Ma. Coming forward to 2017, we are in our fifth generation of family business in Chinatown. The rhythm of Chinatown has uh, somewhat has changed and has lost. Uh, I pine for the days when uh, I had a relative that used to be bad chested pulling a dolly with two baskets of bean sprouts that he grew over many evenings. Um, and all the hellos of all the bachelors, of all the uh, hand truck pushers and coffee shop uh, counter men. Um, and it was a very special romantic time for me. Um, we have a turnover of residents in our community now. The local uh, population has been displaced by this uh, increase in rent and real estate turnover, and the mom and pop shops have been pushed out. Um, so every three to four years, we have a turnover of the residents in, in the buildings that uh, line the streets of Chinatown. Um, this creates a very transient uh, population that aren't very invested in community building or sense of neighborliness. They're here to partake in the party environment of New York City and they, it's, a, it's a bedroom community for the rest of uh, New York City. So when we share our living memories, uh, we feel a deep connection. As I said earlier to you, we are all channels, uh, channels for this Chinese American experience. We, we together create the complete picture of Chinese and Americas. They're in these little moments of daily activities. It's the longtime business owner that go, wakes up every day and opens up shop and stays open till 6 p.m. Um, it's the uh, longtime grandmother who walks up her six-story walk up every day to um, open her door and you know continue on her uh, daily routine. So I think it's like those small moments of people continuing their daily life in Chinatown and, and believing in this community and wanting to be a part of it um, that I hold on to here. Um, even for, I mean, our family, it's like my grandma, I always saw my grandmother and my grandfather open up shop, my grandfather waking up at a certain time every day, um, burning incense here in the shop, and my grandmother always being in the back kitchen preparing food. Um, and those things, like those are consistent despite the rapid changes that we're seeing right now. Um, and it's, it's easy to forget those because they're so consistent in every day um, versus, you know, these changes of uh, businesses being displaced and longtime residents being displaced. But it's important to uplift those stories and remember that people are still being resilient in their everyday life here. Chinatown is my Chinatown and it's my home. This is home. We, we are, are here, here to stay. stay.